pissed off with what you're doing. Have you ever wanted to automatically generate an outline but you don't know how? So you search up and only find videos about different drawing softwares other than yours? Then I totally got you. Today, I will show you guys how to do outlines in Ibis Paint, Procreate, and Clip Studio Paints. I don't want to waste the time, so let's get started with Ibis Paint first. What you're gonna do is you're going to save your drawing with a transparent background, then paste it under the layers of your original drawing. Now, you're going to go to Filter, then to Style, and you're going to press the bevel other pick. I hope I pronounce this right. This creates an outline you can adjust the size of. You are not done though, as you can see, the filter comes with free shading of the outline. And since we do not want the shading, we will alpha lock the layer, pick whatever color you like, and then just fill it in. And da da! You have an amazing outline. In my opinion, this is the easy software to do because now get ready for Procreate. First, you're going to duplicate your layer and remove your background. After you've done that, choose whatever color you want for the outline. Now, select your duplicated layer and select Alpha Lock and fill layer. Next, blur the layer you are on. I recommend blurring it from 10 to 20%. Now, after this, you're gonna go to Select, go to Automatic. Now, click the outside of your drawing and invert it. Now, go to your layers again and fill your layer and again, you have an outline. Gosh, I gave myself a headache while scripting this. Anyway, let's move on to the next one, Clip Studio Paint. As always, you're going to copy and paste the drawing and move it under the other layers. Now, you're going to select the other select tool and press the alt of your drawing. After you've done that, you're going to invert it again. Now, all you have to do is choosing your outline color and going over here to edit. Now, press outline selection and here you can choose the size of your outline as well as if you want your outline to be inside your drawing or outside, we're going to press draw outside. So that's an outline, which means we're done with the video. Thanks for watching until the end, and I really appreciate a like and subscribe since it really took a lot of hours, research, and headaches to do. Anyway, have a nice rest of your day, and see you in the next video.